what it means is that the, the time that elapses between the patient hitting the door of the hospital and the time it takes to hope open the heart artery. We have understood now that the sooner we bring patients who are having a heart attack to uh, an advanced facility that can uh, facilitate opening up the heart artery, the better it is for the patient. Just for example, the, the earlier the patient comes to medical attention and we, we reperfuse the, um, reperfuse the uh, infarcted myocardium, meaning thereby we reopen the channel so that the blood supply is restored to the muscle, the more uh, muscle would be saved. Now, over the last about 10 years, the scientific community, the medical community all over the world has come to realize that there is a, there is a threshold of time we can allow people to, uh, uh, to take to receive this medical care. And it has come to um, a determination that a patient who is beginning to have a heart attack and reports to a hospital within about 90 minutes or earlier than 90 minutes if that person receives the appropriate therapy so that the heart artery is opened, they will suffer less amount of damage to the heart. So this particular time period, which is called door to balloon time, is very important. That period should not be more than 90 minutes. And that has become a very important uh, yardstick to assess the quality of a particular hospital or a healthcare facility. At Rush University Medical Center, we are very proud that for the last about four years, we have consistently provided care to these patients with heart attack within 90 minutes, 100% of the time.